I love me is not driven by patterns. When I am not being myself, then who am I being? I am being driven by my patterns. And when someone is hurting you, when someone is hurting you, you can clearly tell they are not being themselves. They are being driven by their patterns. No one, when I am being myself, it is impossible for me to hurt anyone. And when someone is hurting someone, you can immediately tell they are not loving themselves right now. They are not being themselves right now and they are being driven by their patterns. And when I can take that perspective, when someone is hurting me, instead of feeling, oh, that person really hurt me, I'm hurt. I could come from the perspective of wisdom. Oh God, they are being driven by their patterns. It's coming from compassion, it's coming from understanding. But they are not really hurting me. They are just being driven by their patterns. Because everyone is driven by their patterns if they're not being themselves. All I have to do is to be myself and everything will flow from there. Either I can be a reaction to my situation or I can be myself. Well, what do you mean by either I can be a reaction to my situation? Reaction to my situation, the situation could be from the past traumas, a situation could be from the present trigger. And the reaction is based on my patterns. How I'm going to react is going to be driven by my past patterns. How else am I supposed to react if I don't react from my past pattern? Either I can be a reaction to my situation or I can be myself. I have a choice. When a situation happens, whether I'm triggered by a current situation or a past trauma has awoken for some reason, usually from a trigger. At that time, I can make a choice to be myself or to be driven by my patterns. And when someone is hurting someone, clearly they are being driven by the patterns. If we allow them the space to be themselves, that's the best service we can do. Because when we allow others, when we give them the space to be themselves, then they can be themselves instead of following their patterns. And that's what happens a lot of time in life coaching. A genuine space is made available to allow that person to be themselves and feel safe and not judged. I'm just creating a space for you to be yourself. Now, what if I can create that space for myself? That I can allow myself to be myself when I am triggered. And it's a process. I can't expect that I should always be myself because when the moment I say I should be myself, then you're not being yourself because there's a force. Being myself is effortless. It will come from within. And all I have to do is to become aware of the choices to follow my patterns or to be myself. Those choices are available to all people at all times. And then I can decide, you know, I just want to be myself. Whatever that means to each person at that time. What a way to live.